Hello and welcome to another video and this one is a review of Bridget Jones's Diary, the 25th anniversary edition and let's jump straight in. Um, I did find the book very funny and I found Bridget to be a very quirky protagonist um, though I did find some areas of the book to be quite outdated such the such as the calorie counting segment at each like part of like each, at the start of every diary entry and showing a very blatant sexism from different me like a couple of males in this I guess but the whole point of this isn't to show sexism in the workplace in corporate workplaces. It is just to be a rock city rom-com, so I'm not going to take it too seriously in that regard. And I am entertained by the fact that Colin Firth and Hugh Grant were both mentioned in this, in the book. Um, and it was written 25 years ago, without the author realising that they'd be cast in the film. And I'd find it funny if she did have them in mind. There was lots of family drama that was absolutely wonderful to read as well. There was a bunch of political stuff at the end that I believe is in other books in the series, which I didn't think were necessary for the end of the special edition, so I felt I found that a bit of a drag. Not so much because of the politics, as such but because of just how unnecessary it really was as it doesn't add anything to the book at all and I feel like it was just filling up space to make it a special edition though I did enjoy the comic strip at the end and the cover of a newspaper as well that was quite funny and to do with the politics there is a quote in here that was I think it's especially very still relevant today, which was has anybody has anyone actually tried turning America on and off again? Um, which I forgot to mention a second ago. Um and although I did have some issues with the book, I still enjoyed it a lot and gave it three and a half stars in Goodreads. Um I have already purchased the next one in the series. Um, to be picked up so I will be reading the next one at the very least and I hope you've enjoyed this video today thanks for watching